What up, everybody? It's Joe from Complex. We're back in LA at Flight Club with Austin Mahone. What up? We're gonna do some sneaker shopping. We're gonna browse the shelves, see what he's feeling, and then uh, hopefully we're gonna buy some sneakers. Of course. Let's do it. I saw a video, it was kind of like, might have been a few years ago, and you were up to 103 pairs. Oh yeah. Has the collection grown since then? Yeah, I got like 600 pairs now. Damn. It's crazy, yeah. Sneaker culture is so like yeah. rabid. Are you it, super into it now or just casual? I wouldn't say I'm like a huge sneaker head because mm -hmm. I'm not going to sit here and tell you like all the shoes. Like, I, don't, I don't know all of them, mm -hmm. but I just, I love just collecting them. The shoe that started it all, yeah. the Jordan 1. Mm -hmm. Did you actually get a chance to own a pair? I did. This was my first Jordan. My mom bought them for me like in fifth grade. I still have them. They look terrible. Yeah. Yeah, because I've worn them like for like two years straight. I'm just all dirty and stuff. But Sometimes they look better dirty though, yeah. you know? Yeah, more, yeah. Is that the shoe that got you into sneakers? I kind of picked up the hobby a little later, but um, I remember like every like year or two, I would get a new pair of shoes. Mm -hmm. And uh, and so once I got those, I started to get more into Jordans and stuff. And so that's kind of where it all started a little bit. I love performing in either the threes or the fours, just because of the toe. Yeah. I feel like the toe and the fours and the threes are so strong, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Like I, I can get on my toes, I like to glide, I like to dance, so it's just a, a strong shoe to dance in. What do you think about like the new type of Jordans, kind of like these Futures right here? I actually love the Futures. Yeah? Um, I, I think they're super comfortable. I like to use them to play basketball in. Like, really? You ball in these? Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. That's mine. Hey, hey. How competitive are you with sneakers? Like some people, we're in this kind of culture of we have to have them first and we yeah, have to Instagram them first. Yeah. Do you like that or, or not really? Not really. Like I, I see people like wait outside for like three days or something crazy yeah. and like just like sleep on the sidewalk for like shoes. And it's like, you know, if I, if I come across them, I'll get them. I'm not gonna wait outside for them. Which NBA player do you think has the best signature sneakers? Oh, that's a good question. I would say probably LeBron. I was at the Spurs game the other day. Yeah. And I was watching, like, I was like just watching the game. I was on the court and I saw like everyone's sneakers and a lot of people had LeBron's on. Yeah. It this must be weird for him to play against people who are wearing sneakers. Yeah, it's sneakers. like, it's, it'd be kind of weird, right? Yeah. All right, so Austin, let's head over here and talk about your favorite sneaker according to the internet. Okay. The Yeezy 2 in black and pink. Is it okay. still your favorite sneaker? Um, I don't remember a time when I said that was my favorite sneaker. It's documented on the internet, I swear. I don't know where that came from. <laughs> but uh, I mean, it's, it's, I think it's a great sneaker. Um, yeah. That, I mean, it's one of my favorites. I don't have the Red O's yet. Yeah. Those are crazy. Gotta get those sometime. I think they're cool. How do you feel about him as a designer? I mean, what I've seen so far with these, I mean, they look cool. So I mean, yeah. I think it's cool. But I'll tell you my favorite pair right now. My favorite pair are the uh, the Air Max from Back to the Future. Oh, you know, they're from, right, yeah, they're right there. I wanted these for like two years, and I was like, yo, like I gotta find these, and I would just look everywhere, and I can never find them. So I went to um, the same store in, in New York, and then I asked them, I was like, yo, please tell me you got these in my size. And they're like, we actually have one pair left in size 11. I was like, wow, wow. Do you mind how much you? Pay I asked how much you paid for them. It was a dagger. Really? It was uh, seven grand. Yo, Tiny Tempa paid like 40 grand for them, so you got no off way. pretty. Yeah, you you got off pretty easy. Dumb. What's your favorite pair of sneaker? My favorite Turning pair? Turning the tables around now. What's My favorite, favorite pair? pair? Black cement threes. Yeah? Yep. These are the first Good choice. These are the first shoes that Tinker designed. And it was rumored that Jordan was gonna go to Adidas. Yeah. And Tinker met him and was like, this is the shoe that I designed for your next shoe. Yeah. And save Jordan staying with Nike. Wow. So I really like That's these. Intense. Yeah, these are my favorite. And then the, the black cement fours. Let's see what sneakers you want to try on, and hopefully they have your size, and we can go Do from it. there. Man, this is tough. I like this section over here. Look at yeah, my there's a lot to there. choose from. What about these? You like these? Yeah, those are sick. Yeah? Classic. Which one out of these two would you get? I like the black and red better, but both are really classic shoes. I don't know. That white and black is looking clean, though. Go for it. Those are cool? Yeah, definitely. And he had some... Classic games in those. I kind of want to get these. Uh, Throw in the bag. Nine? Damn. Oh, nine in these? Ooh, back on the shelf. Okay, I'm going to get these and these right here. Perfect. Yeah, we'll get these wrapped up. $790, yeah. 25 cents. All right, thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Austin, thanks for coming through, man. Appreciate it. Complex, thank you so much. You guys are the best. Thank you.